Good morning, dear students. Welcome to our online classes. At present, I am in the seventh standard first language English class. So, dear students, in the previous class, we already finished up the poem. Which poem we already finished up in the previous class? Yes, remember yourself. Here, the last poem, "Work is Worship," the great poet of Indian literature, uh, known as uh, Rabindranath Tagore, already. That uh, work, work is one worship poem. We have to finish it in this class. Now it is the time to understand the new poem. The new poem, but it is a very crucial position. That means uh, the ideas, the ideas in the poem became very precious. But uh, when we have to find out that those thoughts are very sharp. So. The name of the poem is the convergence, convergence of the twin. This uh, imagine it. It, it is not an imaginative. It is a reality. The reality, the in front of the incident happened. That incident, Thomas Hardy mainly explosive, exclusive report or information given in this poem. That is. The convergence of the twin. Twin means two. What is the meaning of twin? Twin means two. So here, what is the convergence? Convergence means coming together towards a common point. Coming together towards a common point of twin two. Yes, in that poem, what he mainly expresses. So we have to understand with the poem. So everyone should open your textbook and uh, uh, receive that, observe that lines of the poem. Here, the convergence of the twi twin, twin lines on the loss of the Titanic. There is a biggest uh, ship in the world that is Titanic. We already know that the film also released. Titanic, that is a wonderful film. How to the Titanic ship sank in the ocean? We already observed that in the film. But here, in the, in this poem, in this poem, Thomas Hardy main hardly express how to sank that uh, the biggest uh, ship into the ocean. So. The explanation uh, is given in that uh, poem here. So everyone should uh, observe that in uh, in bracket of the lines. Long ago, there was a terrible accident in the Atlantic Ocean. A ship called Titanic sank. Thousands of people died. There was no electronic signaling system at that time. Thomas Hardy mainly explained about to how to the biggest Titanic ship sank into the ocean. In which ocean the Titanic ship is sank in? Atlantic Ocean. So here, long ago, there was a terrible accident. There is a terrible, terrible means very unimaginative, unimaginative uh, accident in the Atlantic Ocean happened. A ship called Titanic sank. A ship called Titanic sank. Sink, first of all, sank. So, the Titanic ship totally sank into the ocean of Atlantic. The next point is that thousands of people died. In that, some of the OS people, OS travelers are there in that ship. They are totally died. There was no electronic signaling system at the time. In that big, biggest ship, there is no there is no signaling system when the people thousands of people are traveling in that ship so that is the major reason if the signals are there signal system are there means in that ship or boat 
at the time we have to save minimum of thousands of people people uh, livingness so the last line here thomas hardy sees the hand of fate in that accident read the poem and find out more about the accident here in this poem thomas hardy mainly used the one phrase the hand of fate that is a not a good luck some of the uh, people some of the people are trying to get uh, uh, live their uh, breath when the uh, titanic uh, ship sank into the ocean so in this way we have to start the poem here and as a small ship grave in the stator grace and hue in the sad very sorry sad way in the sad way silent distance grave the iceberg too thomas hardy mainly here heart touching story here in that and as the smart ship which is a smart ship here titanic ship grave in stator stator means what do you know that size and importance we are given more importance that uh, titanic ship but here what will happen what happened there grace here grace means quality of being beautiful it is it look like a very beautiful ship but here what happened hue the degree of brightness in color it is a very attractive attractive ship but it is sank into the ocean that is our uh, bad luck here the next in a short way silent distance grave grave in the, the iceberg too iceberg is located it is a place in that place uh, it is in a atlantic ocean in that place the titanic ship was totally sank that is the description of in the first three lines the next one alan they seem to be no mortal i could see the intimate welding of their later history alan they seem to be no mortal eye could see the intimate welding of their later later history alan means here here so different as to be the opposite of one another incompatible here alan means what so different as to be the opposites of one another incompatible so alan it is a totally different we have to say to be no mortal i there is a no mortal mortal i means there is no merciless merciless of the eyes are there why because thousands of people died in that the next the intimate the intimate welding here the intimate welding of their later history after the titanic ship was totally sank into the ocean at the time what will happen what will happen in the next lines we have to see there or sign that they were bent by paths kind coincident on being anon twin hal halvis of one august event till the spinner of the years said now and each one hears and uh, conjunction comes and jars to hemispheres so in this way we have to observe that thomas hardy mainly express expression about 
how the beautiful and attractive the biggest ship like Titan is totally sank into the ocean of Atlantic near iceberg. So this is the main uh, main theme of this poem and uh, this poem is completed here. Today itself I will send you the textual question answer and you should write very neat handwriting in your fair notes along with you have to research one or two times and you should take signature on Saturday. Okay, thank you.